not the only one that's having problems with their fucking alarm going off, bro. I set my alarm for 9 a.m. and that shit did not fucking ring. But right now, I'm about to go ahead and check out the Porsche Panamera getting ceramic coated by my boy. Stay tuned for that. No, this thing is sick though. So you just did the one step right here? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know if they could even be able to see it in the camera. You can in the sun. <laughs> So basically, we just decided on what we were gonna do with the Panamera. My boy preferred this two step over the one step. It takes, you know, about twice the amount of time, but my boy is hooking it up right here. They're all mobile and shit, pulling up. And yeah, man, this thing's about to get a completely, basically new paint job in a way. So with this car, we're doing a two step paint correction. Yeah. Um, so first, we're doing using a Meguiar's cutting pad and then Sonex Ultimate Cut to remove about 70 to 90% of the swirls. Um, especially on a black car, it's pretty bad because, uh, you know, you guys just takes it to flagship all the time. <laughs> yeah, you know, right, exactly. <laughs> Again, after. Okay. And then after that, we wipe everything down with alcohol and coat it in the ceramic coating. Okay. boy that's doing the ceramic coating right now is only 18 years old bro he said his best month he did $35,000 just using a Facebook ad marketing agency that shit's crazy as fuck because like he said he started doing this two years ago his best month without the marketing agency was only eight grand and it's just crazy how like you just have to start doing something to be able to like start seeing the fruits of your labor bro and it's like with anything bro I started social media shit six months ago Shit's taking off now, and um, he started his shit two years ago, bro. And like, bro, I'm about to start doing ceramic coats and shit. This shit's wild as fuck. before yeah now nah, that shit was actually mad motivating bro because i mean being 18 years old and grossing thirty five thousand dollars in a month that shit's wild as fuck i'm about to go home and work hard as shit bro because i'm i don't think i've ever had a, a gross of 35 in a month you know what i'm saying so that shit's dope bro i'm happy for him and yeah man it, with flipping cars is different right I don't think you can necessarily say you're grossing this X amount because the money you invest into the car, you're getting it right back. I just look at profit margins with cars, so it's different. Yeah, I've, I've done, you know, $120,000 gross with cars, but that's not necessarily the truth because you have to put up that initial investment, what, $80,000, $50,000, $30,000, and you make back between five, you know, anywhere between three, five, six, seven thousand dollars. So I look at it differently with gross when it comes to cars. But yo, 18 years old, bro. This nigga is, is doing his thing, bro. That shit's wild as fuck. Panamera is done now. As you can see, it's right in the sun. Can't see any swirls. It says about between 70 and 90 percent of all swirls will be gone. This shit is crazy. Wow. This thing will feel like a brand new car, bro. This paint look crispy as shit. It looks like it's fresh off the fucking lot. Man. That's the thing with black cars, man. Like, they show all the imperfections extremely easily, man. And, you know, it's harder to keep a black car clean than any other color, in my opinion. Look at this, man. This is broad daylight, too. The sun is beaming on this shit. And you can still see the glitter from the factory paint. Like I said, it's 70 to... 90% of all imperfections will be gone with a two-step paint correction. Look at that shit, man. This thing is crazy. The crystals, you can see the specks in the paint again. Wow. And this beats getting a brand new paint job in my opinion because a new paint job on this car is probably like 5 G's. This thing is insane. Sheesh. About to put the spoiler up right now. Batmobile activated. That shit is wet, man. 
Wow. This car is sick as shit. What the fuck? Looks like a brand new car now. We got the tents on it now, man. All the way around. It's broad daylight. Like I said, the sun is beaming right now. And you can't see shit inside of this car. Imagine at nighttime. This thing is sick, man. 2018 looks like a 2023. Wow. This thing is insane, bro. What the fuck? Down below, if you were to see this on the road, what do you think year this car would be? Uh, this shit to me looks like a 2023, personally. Well, it's a 2018. Porsche doesn't do too much changes to its body styles for a while because it's a timeless vehicle, man. But look at this thing, man. What the fuck? Sheesh. Wow. The wing. They did everything. They even did the wing. That's insane. Wow. Yeah, shout out to my boys. I'm going to uh, tag their information in the bio. Go show some love. He's out in the DMV area. 100% mobile, but he's getting a shop soon. Like I said, man, look at this job, man. 10 out of 10. Great customer service, too. And he's only 18 fucking years old, bro. That shit is wild, man. Damn. So if you're wondering on the tents, it's 3% on the sides, which is basically limousine tent. And then it's 20% on the windshield. But man, the tents and the paint together, this thing looks like you just disappear at night, man. Shit's crazy as fuck. Oh, the daytime running lights are on too. Wow. Look at this thing, man. Insane, bro. Insane. 